France has also rejected Niger's coup-imposed government decision made on Thursday to denounce military pacts with Paris. This is Turkish President Recep Erdogan has praised Africa's efforts to end cooperation with its former colonial overseer. Of course, this is not the first thing France has done. The practices in Algeria in the past, in Rwanda, are all now available in records around the world. Africans know this very well. They've completely stopped the shipment of gold and uranium. It's the reward for the oppression inflicted on these countries. We are just trying to maintain our positive relations. Niger holds the seventh place in the world in terms of uranium production, accounting for almost 5% of global output. Meanwhile, French counterinsurgency troops have been in the West African region for a decade and currently have around 1,500 soldiers in Niger. France concentrated its forces in the country following coups in neighboring Mali and Burkina Faso in 2021 and 2022. The United States also has over 1,000 troops in Niger operating out of two bases. Nigerians are calling on the economic community of West African states to lift sanctions on the country and support the withdrawal of foreign troops from their soil. We demand the immediate departure of foreign military forces and occupations, including French forces. It is high time for these forces that have been driven out of Mali and Burkina Faso to leave Niger. We demand from ECOWAS the unconditional lifting of all unjust decisions against our country. Finally, we call on the people of the ECOWAS countries to go out en masse in the cities and capitals to disavow the leaders of these puppet, corrupt and mercenary institutions acquired in the pay of imperialist France. Niger should not be a testing ground for an anti-coup force. Niger will not be a testing ground for this ECOWAS force to restore an order that has already fallen. My presence here is to show my rejection as a whole of the inhuman, illegal and illegitimate sanctions have been imposed by organizations under the leadership of international powers. ECOWAS is a dutiful puppet of France because all that we see happen is from ECOWAS. France guides ECOWAS, which puts the French will in force. So we say ECOWAS is not independent, but is there to serve France. All that is happening in ECOWAS are measures from France that ECOWAS implements, even if it's illegal.